Hey guys, you're watching Boondocking with Dennis. We just had about 90 minutes of real heavy rain. Oh, what the heck, I'll even stop at the stop sign. Hell, I'm even gonna throw on my turn signals. I think there's only two people out here in the whole beach. And one of them's parked over there, probably taking a nap like I just was. I would say it rained a little bit, guys. What do you think? Now we can read all about skimmers now that the road is open and the skimmers aren't in this area. <laughs> I just saw some skimmers earlier today, actually. Rockport Beach, Rockport, Texas. Had some big boomers going on. And everything's kind of headed that way now. I wanted to say good morning to my friend Drew. Ooh, did you guys hear that? I just mentioned Drew and the thunder starts. <laughs> Look at this. Eugene, get out of the rain, buddy. There's that thunder again. He's like, get out of the truck and get the casting net going. Well, first off, Eugene, it's a cast net. Apparently, that drives people crazy if I call it a casting net. la de freaking da <laughs> Hey, guys. It's wet at the beach. We better get out of here. I want to say good morning to my buddy, Drew. Drew, how's it going, eh? Roll my intro. Well, at least there's fresh water for the birds. I actually went online. Lake Corpus Christi is at 77% capacity, which is good. But Choke Canyon above that is at 34% capacity. So apparently Lake Corpus Christi is getting the rain and Choke Canyon is not. Did you like that uh, intro that I shot yesterday when it was sunny? <laughs> We're not supposed to get rain for about 30 minutes. I'm going to try to cook some food real quick. Let's give that a shot.
I just saw someone bringing a boat in and I didn't even want to film them because I got nothing nice to say about bringing a boat out into the bay, a small boat, under these type of conditions. Just call the Coast Guard before you leave. Just want to give you a heads up. I'm going to tell a dad joke. You, you might want to switch over to my friend Jamie Macon's channel right now. Check out her channel. She does different things, but it's mostly trains. And she's got a special place in her heart for the older trains. Got a joke from my friend Gary. Going down the road, and I saw a sign that said lobster tails, $2. Lobster tails, $2. Went, Man, I got my $2 out. Went up to the window. Said, I'd like a lobster tail, please. Give the guy my two bucks. He said, thank you. Once upon a time, there were two lobsters. <laughs> thank you, Gary. That's a good one, buddy. Lobster tails, come on. Come on. It is rough out there, guys. That might be it for the heavy rain today, guys. It is windy, though, and some of the gusts are pretty bad. I'm glad I didn't go to Port Aransas today as much as I want to go, but... We got to have a sunny day coming up somewhere when the beach is drivable. It's going to happen. Oh, it's going to happen. Yeah, we got some rain. It's supposed to start again in about 30 minutes. And the wind is 17 miles an hour. Which I'm sure my microphone is picking up. And uh, when it was raining heavy, the gusts were in the 20s. So the black skimmers that I love, guys, they literally skim on the water with just their lower jaw touching the water and that's how they hunt for fish well I just saw one of the chicks doing that exact thing but in the wet parking lot not even where the water puddles were but just a, a wet parking lot and uh, I think he needs to go back in for some training <laughs> he's uh he'll learn I do love the skimmers. Skimmers might be my favorite bird. I don't know. I like blue heron, but that's because of Eugene. But the, the skimmers aren't here all year, so there's, there's something special when they come and you get to see their chicks grow a little bit before they take off. The whooping cranes are pretty cool, too. There's just a lot of cool birds. I can definitely say that my favorite land animal is bison. It has been uh, for the last few years and when I got to be among them in Cap Rock Canyon like a crazy person, I was in my truck, don't worry, except when they surrounded me then I wasn't in my truck but I'm sure I've to told those stories before and you can check out my Cap Rock Canyon video if you get real bored and aren't interested in that. Yep, it's going to rain again. There's a dad and his kids out in the water. And why not? The heat index is 91 right now, guys. It was 109 at this time yesterday. So at least we get some cooler weather out of it. I can still hear some thunder. Anyone know what kind of palm trees they are? Pretty fascinating. I'm actually going to head over to the library. Maybe I can get uh, in there before the rain comes. I need to use the computer and then act like I'm reading a book and fall asleep and take a nap in the air conditioning. <laughs> now the seagulls like that one. <laughs> Thanks for riding along today, guys. I appreciate you. Thanks for watching.